So every year we have a tree, but we decorate it with pictures from throughout the past year. We compile a bunch of pictures that we've had, different memories, different events we've been to, different cool things we've done, and we put them on little ornament hooks. And it's really cool for family and friends to come over and look at the pictures on the tree and see the memories that we've shared with them and we've shared as a family throughout the year. On the third day of the four-day holiday, it's the Diwali day, so on that day we light small clay lamps uh, and candles, visit friends and family, uh, we eat a special meal together. The Indian community does a fireworks show that we see every year. Me, my brother, my parents, and my grandparents all travel down to Louisiana. The family that's down there cooks a lot of traditional Louisiana food like jambalaya, they make shrimp po'boys, and it's just a lot of fun times because it's good food and spending a lot of time with my family, which is something that I really enjoy. I'm obsessed with sugar cookies, and so Christmas is the time that I can just eat as many as I want, and so we always just like get the dough. We cut them out. You know that the stars are simple enough that they work, but the reindeer are so complex that they never work. My sister and I are really close, so I always loved activities that we do together. I'm from Miami and my cousins and most of my relatives live in Tallahassee, Florida, which is about an eight hour drive from Miami. So me and my mom pile into the car and we drive up. And it's really cool because I don't really get to see my cousins that much. And that's like the one time of the year where we all come together and just spend quality time together. And I really enjoy that. When I think of Hanukkah, I think of my grandma making potato pancakes and spending all day in the kitchen and the way her apartment smells so good. One of the holiday traditions that we have is that we all sit around in my grandma's living room watching Elf. She has always has like a big bowl of M&Ms. It's like the nice idea of just being together in the same space, which is really invaluable over the holidays. Every year we would decorate our house, but we really wouldn't put too many lights on the outside because we lived in a very rural area and nobody would see them. So what my mom would do instead, she would take my brothers and I downtown to see all the lights. And if we passed a house that we particularly liked, then she would make these elaborate Christmas cards to put in their mailboxes, thanking them for such a, a magnificent light display. Every year we will get the batches of cookies and we'll go out and like pack individual plates for each of the neighbors. Just knock on the doors and just say like, hey, happy holidays. There's a little cute old couple across the street and they were just so touched by it. And she goes, wait, I have something for you. And she like wobbles her way into the house and grabs her little homemade sweet potato pie and wobbles her way back out. And I was like, oh my gosh, like that is the cutest thing ever. 